hey guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video we'll be looking at how to install google chrome browser on a linux mint now by default we only have uh, firefox to check what you have just go to the bottom left here on the this icon click on it and then go to internet and you see what you have available so we have uh, the Firefox web browser. So if you, you need to, or if you wanted to use, if you want to use Google Chrome, you'll need to install it. Now to install it, we'll need to download the Google Chrome and then do the installation. Just click on Firefox to open it. And once you have Firefox open, you can search for Google Chrome, download, and then just go to the link that takes you to google.com so click on this once you get to this page you see here you have download chrome click on this then you'll see this new window that pops up it says get chrome for linux and then you have the option for debian slash ubuntu this is the option that you want make sure you have this selected and then click on accept and install and it, this should allow you to begin the download so the download is in progress And uh, the download is completed. We can now minimize this. Okay, now we can go and check on our downloads folder. So if you look in the downloads folder, you see that we have the file we just downloaded. So we'll open the terminal here, and then we'll do ls. Then we'll need to see it to the downloads folder. LS again, and this is the file that we need to install. Now the command to install the file is gonna be, uh, we'll do sudo dpkg hyphen i, and then we need to type this file right here, this whole file that we downloaded. So we'll do Google hyphen so Chrome and we can do tab completion. All we have to do now is just to press on the tab key. That should complete the file name for us. And then press enter. And then here you just need to type in your uh, admin password. Uh, we'll wait for the installation to be done. So as you can see here, we got an error message, which is saying that uh, we have uh, dependency problems. So this package here is missing. So we we need to install it since it's, uh, it's not installed. Now the, the command for resolving that issue is rather long so i'm just gonna copy and paste it so this is the command wget http colon forward slash archive and then the rest of it just press enter now this this file here has been saved we just need to install it the command to install it it's uh, sudo dpkg i and then this name here lib 2f dash udev type completion now that we have that dependency installed let's go ahead and uh, do the installation of google chrome again 
using the, the previous command we typed in. Just press enter. And now here we are not seeing any error messages, no dependency issues. Now let's uh, check the version of Google Chrome. It should also verify for us that we actually successfully installed the Google Chrome. So that's the version. That should tell us that uh, Google Chrome was installed successfully. Now we go to the menu here and then go to internet. And now we have Google Chrome listed. You just click on it. And you're getting a pop-up window asking you to make Google Chrome your default browser. Um, I'll go with this, just click on OK. I'll minimize that window. And now we have Google Chrome here. Uh, let's just search for something on YouTube. And there you go, we're able to use our Google Chrome browser. So if you have an account, you can go ahead and uh, click here to sign in. You can also check the version here. You can go to the settings by clicking on these three dots here. Uh, here you have the uh, different options. And then you have help. And you can go to about Google Chrome. We should show you the same version we, we saw earlier. And you can make changes. You can customize the uh, Google Chrome to fit whatever you you want it to look like. So that should be pretty much it for this um, video. You just have to watch out for that error message, the dependency issue that you might run into. That's the only issue you might run into, but if you're able to put this command in, you should be able to resolve that dependency error message we got when we try to install the Google Chrome. So I hope this uh, information has been useful or helpful. Thanks for watching. See you in my next video. Bye.